condition yourself to recognize the unlimited transformative potential that you have. You have to understand something. This is the reason why God will never give up on you because God sees in you what you fail to see in yourself. And that's that unlimited potential that you have. You're blinded by it because of your unconscious societal programming mechanisms from the matrix. Check it out. The moment you come to this earth, they only train you to recognize your ordinary self, the pedestrian mentality, you know, the egocentric mind trap, you know, telling you that you're going to fit in and be a number and, and just, you know, that type of thing, a barcode on your forehead, that type of thing. They didn't make you aware of anything for a reason. They don't make you aware of your powers for a reason. Nobody motivated you. Nobody trained you. Nobody inspired you to realize your higher self for a reason. Because when you stay plugged into your higher self, you will always know your unlimited transformative potential. And you will always see this as it is, as an illusion. You see how they work you when you come here? When, you, when you're born into this world, your parents don't know any better. Your brothers and sisters don't know any better. Your friends in the neighborhood don't know any better. The people that you associate with as far as the kids in school, you hang out after school. And when you get older, you know, you go to junior high school, high school. And then you go to college and, you know, you get a job. All those people don't know better. You go to the gym, you go out to eat, go stay with relatives. They don't know better either. You might come across one or two that, that may perhaps know something about it. But it's just basically all the rest. That's why you're not getting any conflicting information. You're not getting any information of an outside source to contrast or, you know, bring any type of contention against what they've trained you to believe. Because when you come to this world, you're a blank slate, right? Okay, so they say, okay, blank slate, we're going to write on you. We're going to write an operating system and a software program that you are going to follow. And that's exactly what your mind does. Because you're trained to believe that you are these things, so therefore it becomes your identity. Am I making sense? I know I am. That's why you have your identity that you refer to in times of trouble or aggravation or, you know, uncertainty. You revert to your database, your knowledge information center that they put in there. And everything in there is a lie. So what do you have to refer to? Just lies and misinformation and disinformation. And they keep the truth from you. That you are an unlimited transformative potential. Uh, you have an unlimited transformative potential. And you are a super dynamic, esoteric, cosmic alchemist. Capable of, capable of manifesting greatness and miracles anytime, anywhere. You know, you are your greatest miracle. You are your greatest treasure. You don't find anything in this life. You create it. That's the straight truth. You can manifest anything you want. Absolutely. They don't tell you any of this stuff in school. They don't even, they don't even encourage you or, or teach you how to invest money or make money in the school. What do they teach you in your schools? Polynomials and the Dewey Decimal System? What the heck are you going to use with that? That's useless information. Now they have Common Core Mathematics, which is a, 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 a debacle. It's a deliberate debacle. One plus one equals two. I don't care what anybody tells you. It doesn't equate a 45-minute equation. They're deliberately convoluting the simplistic because divinity is simplicity. Convoluted madness is the matrix. So that's why I'm just giving you a heads up because God doesn't give up on you for a reason because God sees the unlimited transformative potential in you that you fail to see in yourself for a reason because God realizes you've been conditioned to defeat yourself. As I've said before, recognize that you have been programmed for failure by laughing at the notion of your own success. This is your inclination to have you tend to lean towards your self-destructive tendencies. Because that is your default mechanism. That is your go-to. That's all you know. Like they say, go for what you know. For what you know is, that's it. That's all you got to go to. And that, unfortunately, is something that's crippling you from the inside out. That's why the universe isn't going to give up on you. I hope you see this.